Hey guys, it's Rachel, and today I have my August favorites. First off are my nails, for sure. I mean, they kind of match my shirt, but I just, oh, I love this light blue. It's showing up a lot brighter on camera, but it's not that bright. So, it's mostly all beauty products, of course. Um, yeah, let's just get right into it. So, first off, my new favorite foundation of all time, I think, for right now. I have also ordered um, some NYX stuff, and I ordered a NYX foundation, the matte but not flat, I think is what it's called. But this is the Rimmel London Stay Matte Foundation, and I have it in True Ivory, and I love this. I'm not wearing it today, of course. When are people ever wearing their favorites in their favorites videos? Today I wanted to just kind of go back to my BB cream, but I love this. It has amazing coverage. I just use um, this like beauty blender that is dirty to do my makeup with it and it's almost like I don't need a concealer because it conceals on its own. So, and that was very inexpensive. It's like $5. So, Alright, I'll stick with face right now. So then this bronzer by e.l.f. It is in the color Tan Toffee. It just kind of looks like that. And I like it a lot for it's like brownie. It's a good color because it's kind of gray toned for contouring. It's not like orange toned, if that makes sense. But like orange tone bronzers don't look good when you try and contour with them, but they're good for all over. But the one thing I will say with this is there is a lot of fallout. It's only like $3, which is probably why, but I love it for contouring when I contour. Once again, didn't contour today, but it does have a lot of fallout, so there's that to keep in mind. Um, next for face is this blush by Wet n Wild called Pearlescent Pink. It was in my recent drugstore haul, and oh, this is just the prettiest color. Look at that. I love it. I just really do. I have it on. I have this on today, but I mean, it's towards the end of the day, so it's kind of faded. But it's just a very nice pink color. Okay, and... Now we'll move on to eyes. So I have been loving the um, Star Looks, Looks Longwear Eyeliner Pen that I got in my Ipsy bag, but it just has a weird smell. <laughs> but I love the black color, and I love how easy it is to draw on and then do my wing, although sometimes I mess up my wing with this too. So I've been using this, and then going over it with this, which is the e.l.f. Precision Liquid Eyeliner. I just heard that noise. My phone just vibrated. Um, yeah, so the e.l.f. Liquid Precision Liquid Eyeliner in black. And I've just been going over that one with this after I do my makeup because it may not show up, but okay, it kind of is. This is blacker than that, which is what I like. I like it to be a very dark line. And then the mascara I've been loving is the Mega Length Wet n Wild one, and it is this just like a very thin brush, so it makes it easy to get very close to your waterline and just separate your lashes and everything. And also this one by e.l.f. called the 3 in 1 Mascara. It scared me the first time, so... Alright, so it looks like that. And, I mean, it is a little intimidating. But what you have to do is like use this part and then the ball part of it differently, which is weird and a little hard to do at first, but when you figure it out and you get it to work, it is a very nice mascara. And it says it defines, lengthens, and volumizes, and I think it sticks true to all of that. <laughs> okay, and then my two for lips um, are the e.l.f. Moisturizing Lipstick in Flirty and Fabulous, which is this hot pink. I've been wearing it in a lot of my recent videos. It's just a very pretty, it's almost matte, but it does have some shine to it. But it's like a Barbie pink. And then this that I got in my um, Ipsy bag, and it is the Hikari lipstick in Merlot. And I feel like the girl is part of Ipsy, but I'm not sure. But it is just this pretty very like wine color. I mean, its name is Merlot, so what are you going to expect? 
So that's what that looks like, and I love it. I think it is such a pretty color, and it works really well on your lips, surprise. Okay, next favorite is the e.l.f. Shine Eraser Oil Wipes. These are my summer favorites. They will forever be in my favorites um, because they're a dollar and you get 50 sheets. Whereas, like, there's a lot of them where you get 70 for like $4. So, I'd rather pay a dollar and get 50. I don't even care if it's a little bit less. But they kind of look like this. They have aloe, oh, green tea extract in them. But you just kind of take one and just like blot it all over your skin. Get rid it, get rid. <laughs> It gets rid of your excess oil, but it doesn't mess up your makeup, which I love. So you can just do it without even looking in a mirror because it's not going to mess up anything. Next um, is this. It is this moisturizer, and it's called the Day Wear Defense. You're supposed to do it in the morning before your makeup, but I like to do it at nighttime before I go to bed so it has the time to like really get into my skin. It's a vitamin E moisturizer, and it's by Nicelle Michael. I don't know how to pronounce that, but I got it at Big Lots for like a dollar ninety-five. Seriously, if you have a Big Lots near you, go there. They have makeup products, like name brand stuff, for really cheap. Cheap candles. I love getting candles there. They even have furniture, like good furniture too, and some clothing and like school supplies and stuff. But I love going there to just look through their makeup and see what they have, because you can get good brands but a discount price which is very nice. It's not like the dollar store where it's kind of hit or miss like sometimes they have expensive stuff sometimes they don't. For this they usually have like every brand. Oh my fingers bleeding again. Isn't that lovely? I cut it at work today. It's the tiniest little cut. It's like a paper cut but I cut it on a can of ketchup when I was trying to get the lid off because I stupidly like grabbed the lid. Very smart. Oh on my lips today is the e.l.f. Seductive. I like, I like it a lot. Yeah. Top that spot off, it looked a little nicky. Okay, then this scent I've been wearing like every day when I want to smell professional or whatever, but it's Body Fantasies, Romance, and Dreams, and it's, it's a very clean scent with like a musky undertone, like floral musky undertone, but it's like clean, it's not like sugary like some perfumes can be which I like some days and other days I don't so I like wearing that one on those off days because it does smell good and they're cheap I've never bought them actually I always get them as like Christmas gifts but I ain't complaining um yeah so those are all of my favorites for the month of August um I mean there's other stuff that I have loved but nothing that I really think I need to say about because I've talked about them in so many videos so these are my August favorites. I hope you guys like this. I plan on doing favorites every single month. Hopefully I'm buying and using and testing enough stuff to be able to um, like set up some favorites for every single month. But I will try my hardest and if there are some repeats, that's okay. Because it's okay to love a product more than one month in a row. Um, I hope you guys like this. Please give it a big thumbs up and comment and don't forget to subscribe. Until next time. Bye guys.